Well, good morning. Welcome to our ramble today. As you can see, we're going to be going up the Horde Monument at Ulverston. Well, the weather's glorious, very hot. I'm hoping we're going to make it, but uh, here we are meeting at Hall Park and getting ready. And we've arrived here now at Ulverston. And we're just outside Ford Park, which is really just at the bottom of the Horde Monument. But we're actually going to walk through town and follow the Cumbrian Way for a bit. Good morning, Norman. Good morning, Bernie. And it's a beautiful morning. Yeah. We're all creamed up. Scorching. <laughs> and uh, ex extra fluids. And uh, we're here, just below the Horde Monument, which looks a bit like a lighthouse, but it isn't. And we're going to walk clockwise, so a little bit of road walking to begin with. And then we strike north along the Cumbria Way. North all up here to here and then return in this direction. And as you can see, I put on lots of reference marks so that we, we, so we, won't get lost. we won't get lost. No. <laughs> and last time we were up in here, we could get lost because it was foggy. It certainly was. Whereas today it's crystal clear. Yeah. And then having got to the top, We've earned our descent, and I think this is where you fell last time. That's right. Yes. Head over heels. That's right. So did. <laughs> just hold on to me this week <laughs> and back to the cars. Yeah. Short walk this week, 5.3 miles, but nearly a thousand feet of oh. up. And the, with the temperature of about 23 yards. The temperature will uh, climb above 23 yeah. today. Oh, very good. Thank you very much. Right. right, so Bern has told us where we're going. We're all gathered up and off we go. We've all got plenty of drinks with us and sun cream on and got the hats on. So hopefully we'll be okay. So I say we're just making our way through a little bit of the town before we get to the beginning of the Cumbrian Way. This is an old brewery that uh, I think they're going to be pulling down and building houses and I think that's what they said. Very nice is Olverston. I've never actually been through these streets before. The cobbled streets and plenty of different shops to look at. I think it'd be worth coming back sometime to have a look around here. I know there's Laurel and Hardy Museum, and, uh, but I didn't know what else there was. Oh, what have we got here? Everybody's stopping to have a look. Oh, Laurel and Hardy. Yeah, very good. The market hall up there. So, uh, chap here watering all the, the plants. Got his big tanker in the back of his, his van and uh, going around watering them all. They look really nice, all these hanging baskets. So, now then. Where do we go? Decisions, decisions. Yeah, well, if you go up there, turn right, oh, start coming away. If you go up here, you're heading to the end to Barrow. <coughs> the lady was saying, well, if you go that way, I'll bet you 50 pounds you'll be back. Because it's the wrong way. So we have to go back a bit. And here we are now at the start of the Cumbrian Way. And this monument is to depict the start. Some fancy painted houses there. Just needed to wanted to put a picture of that in because I didn't actually video it. Stream running very slowly down here. We've got every 
everybody here, have we? I think everybody's right, so we can get ready for going again. I don't really want to stay here. I don't blame them really, it's that hot. I want to weave in there, the different patches, I don't know what that's about. There's no sign saying what it was for. Your labourers are calling you. <laughs> Hello boys, are you alright? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's two Labradors were very quiet till we started walking past and and he was just uh, letting us know we were here. So on we go, Cumbrian Way, here we come. Nice heads of corn on there. Oh, well, there's the horde and we're going the wrong way from it. This is obviously to get the miles in. So we're going to go through this farm. It uh, looks like he's just filling his tanker from the uh, suspect here. Yeah? So okay, so uh, rounding is all up, and we're all going to walk through together because uh, we shouldn't be going through when uh, men are at work. Making our way through here. Cowl being a bit nosy, sticking the reds out. Not much food down there. Looks like they sell the milk for saying that is. Hello! Yeah! Oh, brutal at last. That's good. Well, that pig wrapped himself round. Just thought I'd stick that in as well. So, burned with his orange. I've got orange, and I don't know what the others have got. So this picture as well, put that in, so on we go, and a little slow hot cake hot, didn't actually see where it was, but uh, we haven't time to stop because we've got a lot of walking to do yet, come away, here we go. Oh, I'll have to stop and get my breath back and have another go. Obviously I've speeded that bit up a bit. Dinner time now, oh that's good. And these two young ladies and their horses coming past. <laughs> Alright, dinner time over and on we go. So I just set off ahead of them all. Unfortunately, because I'm going downhill, I could manage that. If they're going up, I can't. So here we go. Some nice properties down here. I just wait for them to join me here and uh, and nice and sheltered. Here they start coming now.
Taco Bell. Just telling them there's a few more coming down. Got it, it's shaded in the wood there. Uh, here's the rest of the tribe. And we've actually decided to cut a, a corner off because we're all getting jaded. So we've cut the corner off and going down the road quite a bit further than we would have done. And I think that's the best idea. Now I've reached another farm now. Turn off just at this other side of this building. These young calves. And going on the fields, I think, shortly. On the camera around let you see the scenery. Very nice, lovely. Ooh, we've got some cows here as well. They were bulls actually. Getting to the point now where uh, I'm really uh, jiggered. So one of the other ramblers and myself, we decided we'll just walk down the road to Wolverston. So uh, just uh, a bit further on here, we have made cut. that decision. <laughs> yeah. So I just thought, oh, there's a nice little bit of artwork here. Donkey comes out to see us. So this is where we've made the decision and we've going back and I've handed the camera over to, to somebody else. So Alan has uh, offered to take over videoing for us. So hopefully you can see the full video. So thank you very much Alan for this. Here comes the cameraman. I just speeded this bit up because they were taking quite a while to come up. There's the horde, that's where they're making for. And when I see that I'm thinking, well, I'm glad I decided to just walk back to Wolverston and not do it. Temperature when they got back to the car on the thermometer it was showing 29 and a half degrees. So that's where we've been up this morning. He's running the camera around just to show you where we actually were up on the top of there so that's actually higher than what the horde is and then we came through past them farms and now we're following the paths to get to to the horde I 
And there it is. So, we're getting nearer. So, they look like we're actually here now and they're just having a look round. Got an estuary there. It was done, it might have been uh, from our side actually, that's not just sure. I'm sure somebody will comment. Just having another look round where we've been. So, we're almost at it now. Oh, look that. A little bit further to go. I thought they were actually there. Anyhow, here they are. So a group picture, but of course two of us are missing. So this is from just outside the hoard, we just run this camera around. Just the steep climb down. Last time I did this, it was very, uh, very foggy. So anyway, we're back at the cars now. So I hope you've enjoyed your time with us, and we enjoyed the time just waiting for them arriving. These are my my pair passengers. So hopefully, see you next time. So it's. Bye for now.